Hello, Phil McCarthy here. Hi, how you doing? And I'm on the Putnam County Trail, Putnam Trail, just at the Westchester County line. See right there, leaving Westchester County, entering Van Cortlandt Park. Bike route in. Now, I just wanted to give you an idea of what this path looks like, this pavement. It's about 10 feet wide of asphalt. And right when you cross into Van Cortlandt Park in the Bronx here, it is a nice trail, a very nice trail here. And they want the Parks Department, it's about a mile and a half. I'm running here, so, so bear with my jittering camera. The Parks Department wants to pave this trail. They want to make it just like that other one, 10 feet wide. Plus they want to have, rip out an additional three feet of clearance on either side. I guess that's for the paving equipment and the heavy machinery and all that. A total of 16 feet of clearance. Getting rid of all these trees, these shrubs, not to mention paving over this trail. And so, I am running with my camera to hopefully bring a little bit of an idea to people what this trail is like and what could be lost if they pave it over. And you'll notice the surface of the path here, most of it is very nice, hard packed, smooth dirt. At spots it gets a little muddy, at spots it gets a little rough, but you can see bicyclists already use this trail. It's perfectly good for cycling, both mountain bikes and road bikes. But they want to pave it over anyway. So, I'm documenting the trail as it is. And even if we lose a battle, at least somewhere, someone will see what a beautiful place this is. People who know me know I love running on the roads. I do love running on pavement, but I also love running on trails. And trails in New York City, trails like this are more valuable than gold. So we gotta protect it. So look at how beautiful this is. Can you imagine? 10 feet of pavement plus extra three feet of clearance. All these trees will be gone. These, those, tre those two trees right there, they'll be out of here. And there's no need for it. So here I am doing my little jog. And I'm heading south, like I said, through Van Cortland Park. And you can see the small railroad ties. This, this path is an old railroad bed. There was, a, there was a railroad that came through here. And you can still see some of the ties there. And uh, they could easily rip out those ties and make it, you know, if they wanted to, just to make it that more accessible and that much easier for people to use. But even that's not necessary. But, uh, See, and right now we're the path goes between two areas of the golf course, Van Cortland Park Golf Course. Right there, golf course. And right over here on the right. Oh, we're still a little ways north of the golf course on the right side. Coming up and get to the golf course. As far as I'm concerned, they could easily clear out 16 feet of the golf course and put it on the sidewalk if they want to. But just look how nice this is. Beautiful fall day. Beautiful, nice, sunny October morning, afternoon. See, there are a few spots here where it gets a little muddy. No problem. You can go through that and go around it. Most of, most of it is like this. Just this beautiful, nice, hard packed dirt. Very easy to run, very easy to walk, very easy to bicycle. And you're right here in nature. New York City. Biggest city in the country. In the Bronx. And you have this beautiful park and this beautiful trail. 
may want to pave it. Okay, here we're passing underneath the expressway. There's a hue and cry from a lot of people when they put the expressway through Van Cortland Park. So if that's that, as if that weren't bad enough, now they want to add more pavement on this beautiful area. There's a little, slightly a little rough, but nothing, nothing serious. That's about as bad as it, as it gets on this whole trail, and that's nothing. A little bit of mud. That's it. See, look at this. Look at this trail. Ninety percent of it, ninety-five percent of it is just like this. Perfectly smooth, flat. Nice hard packed dirt. See there's a golf course, people playing golf over there. Golf course over there. Like I said, put a sidewalk through the golf course if you want to. Don't mess with our trails. And I'm hoping to come across another person here on the trail. Okay, here's somebody up ahead. Just an idea of scale. There's plenty of room for people to run, walk, bike, pass each other with consideration. You don't need 10 feet of pavement. All you need is this, just like this. There's more golf course. We don't need more golf courses. We need more trails. Yeah, like I said, people who know me you know I love running on the roads. Not all the time. We need the trails. We need nature. We need our parks. Was behind me in Westchester County, that trail went up to Tibbetts Brook Park, very nice park up there, and beyond. Most of that trail was right sandwiched between the expressway and an industrial area of Yonkers. It didn't go through this beautiful parkland. And you could, all I could do is hear the, the cars whizzing by. But listen, you don't hear anything except birds and crickets. Bird watching is always good too. So here we are, this little pond over there. We're right coming back into the main area of Van Cortland Park, right up ahead. Apologize for the jittery camera, doing as well as I can while running.
beautiful park here. And right up there is a parade ground, the flats. So now this is a bit wider, you notice. This is right in, really in the main area here of Van Cortland Park. Like I said, the parade grounds, the flats are right up there to the right. Lake off there to the left. Very close now to the uh, main pathway entrance. So this way, the path, this area of the path is a little wider, but when you get back into the woods, it's nice to have a little bit more seclusion, a little bit more in touch with nature. And no pavement. Like I said, in New York City, areas like this, just trails and nature and trees and shrubs. Don't forget the shrubs. People talk about cutting down the trees. What about these bushes and shrubs? They hold their homes for animals. They're beautiful. They're beautiful too. But places like this in New York City are more valuable than gold. Don't let them pave it. It's a little muddy, so what? But uh, save the Putnam Trail. And there's a golf house, whatever, whatever. Now I'm just turning off. That's basically the end of the Putnam Trail. Just turning off here to the flats just to show you exactly where we come out at. Notice this is the course of the uh, this is part of the course for the holiday marathons. Come right up this trail. There's tennis courts. And now we're into the main park area of the flats just beyond the tennis courts there. So thank you for watching. Save the Putnam Trail.